Hey guys, what's up? It's Charlie here, and today we're going to be looking at did they find a Megalodon in the Mariana Trench? So you may be thinking, what is a Megalodon? And where is the Mariana Trench? Well, you're about to find out all of this stuff in this video, but it will change how you see sharks and also the ocean forever. Before we get into it, why not subscribe and press the notification bell too? So first off, what is the Mariana Trench? That is the first question we need to answer because that may be where they found a Megalodon shark. Well, the Mariana Trench is actually a massive canyon, except it's underwater in the deepest part of the ocean. It's around 1500 miles wide, but only 40 miles across. This makes it into a tall, thin trench. And to make things even more interesting, it was made by a volcano erupting into the ocean. The Mariana Trench is also the oldest ocean floor in the world. It dates back to 180 million years ago when the volcano erupted. All of the volcano lava mixed with the water. This then made a very hard rock at the bottom of this trench. And after the Bermuda Triangle, the Mariana Trench is said to be the second most mysterious patch of ocean in the world. There seems to always be boats going missing in the area. And many planes seem to miraculously fall out of the sky whenever they go over the Mariana Trench. Except these planes are never found, even by search parties. But now you may be thinking, what is a Megalodon? Many people do know what this is, so I'll just go over it quite briefly. A Megalodon shark is basically a giant shark. However, many scientists say the shark is extinct. But there are some experts out there who massively disagree and say Megalodon are still roaming the waters today. Except Megalodons only hide in the deepest parts of water. That makes the Mariana Trench one of the best hiding spots. Megalodons also need lots of space. They're around 60 feet and are absolutely massive. And if you think whales are big, Megalodons actually feed on whales. That's right, Megalodons eat whales and other big creatures. The only reason why people say Megalodons are extinct is because people don't see them much. You'd think such a big animal would be seen a lot. But despite there being 10 legitimate sightings on a video I made, many experts have not seen Megalodons. So they assume they're extinct, but many say they live in Mariana Trench. One big fact which suggests Megalodon are below the Mariana Trench is when they went extinct. According to experts, they went extinct 1.5 million years ago. But as we know, the Mariana Trench dates back to 180 million years ago, and they have not explored the whole thing. So there could easily be a Megalodon or many Megalodons hiding out in the Mariana Trench. But if they do live there, they must have to live very deep. The deepest spot of the Mariana Trench is called the Challenger Deep. This measures over 35,000 feet down. To put that into perspective, Mount Everest is only 30,000 feet tall. So it's like flipping Everest upside down and then putting it underground. And then adding 5,000 more feet on top of that. Well, one thing to go down very deep in the ocean are whales. And whales are actually the main meal for megalodons. The Liviatan Melveli whale is actually one of the largest whales known to man. And that whale and the megalodon are ancient competitors. So there's no doubt megalodons are amazing, but who's searching for them? Well, you'd be surprised. There's actually been many searches for megalodon, including in the Mariana Trench. Before they even went to the Mariana Trench, they went to South Africa and Mexico. This is because a few years back, a bunch of South African fishermen witnessed a shark over 30 feet long. Megalodons are around 60 feet long, but a 30 plus feet long shark is still potentially a megalodon. They also went to the Sea of Cortez, right near Mexico. The Sea of Cortez is known for great white sharks, and apparently several locals had said there were megalodons living in the ocean. When they got there, they did find many great white sharks, including one of the world's largest ever recorded great white sharks. However, they did not find any megalodon. But in the summer of 2018, they finally got some luck. They investigated the Mariana Trench. They were recommended not to go there, but the scientists still went. They were able to set a trap up with a camera and they captured a Megalodon shark. According to them, the Megalodon was 75 feet. It also had 270 teeth, and as you can see on the tape, it's absolutely massive. Experts say this could have easily weighed around 100 tons. 
To put that into perspective, that's around 20 elephants. It's safe to say this megalodon is scary and absolutely massive. But now they've found one shark which they can classify as a megalodon, they want to find more. They say there could be many more megalodon living in the Mariana Trench and around the world. They were right when they said the Mariana Trench was the most likely place to find a megalodon. After all, they did actually capture one on tape. But let me know your opinion guys, do more megalodon live in the Mariana Trench? Something that they definitely do. Others think there may be more living megalodons, but not necessarily in the Mariana Trench. And others say the megalodon is extinct, and actually say this footage is faked. But I don't see how you could possibly fake this footage. Plus, it was a real team of experts who went down into the Mariana Trench to capture this. They spent a lot of time and money doing it, and I have to say their efforts have definitely been fruitful. Did you know that 90% of the world's oceans are still unexplored? So it really makes you think, what could possibly be out there? Maybe a life form we've never seen before. Or perhaps the largest animal known to man we don't even know exists yet. Or maybe it's just more megalodon sharks. Either way, it's pretty amazing and also kind of scary. Vote in the poll in the top right corner, what do you think about megalodon sharks? Personally, I'm not ruling anything out seeing as we haven't even explored 90% of the world's oceans. If you guys want more amazing videos, check out my second channel. There are some awesome videos on there and there'll be a link to it on screen in a moment. But as always, thanks for watching, check out some more videos on screen right now, leave a like if you enjoyed and if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.